Welcome back to Barbecue with Greg. Let's put that meat on the grill. Let's get started. Clean out the old charcoal. Scoop up all the dust. Reload with some fresh charcoal. Rake it over to one side. Put my starter cube in and light it up. Put my grill on. There, got a nice heat source there. It's ready to go. Okay, welcome back barbecue friends. Today, we got a nice fall sunny day here. Gonna be cooking up a pork chop, frying up some apple, and making a nice sauce to put over top. So let's get that started. I already got my coals lit here. Just about ready to put things on. So let's start off by seasoning the meat, and then we'll get our apple ready. I'm gonna season that with TBQ's all-purpose meat seasoning. Okay, we got uh, the pork chop season for that savory note. Let's get our frying pan heated up. We'll start off with our apples because that's going to take a little bit longer. Heat up that pan. With the pan heated, we'll throw in our chopped up apples. Fry them up for a bit, then we'll add our butter. Once the butter's melted, we'll give that a bit of a stir. Then we'll add our brown sugar. Once that's melted down a bit, it's about time to put the pork chop on. Let's sit that beside it. Mix all that sugary goodness in with the apples. Okay, the apples are all soft here. The sugar's reducing down. It's time to pull this off. Okay, I kept the handle outside of the barbecue so it stays cool. Let's set that there for now. I put an upside down cookie sheet here to take some of the heat because I don't want to put the pan on the shelf. We've got a nice fall meal here, got a nice pork chop, nice apples which are in season right now, which we gotta taste that. Mm. Oh boy, those apples are just nice and soft and candy like. Mm. It's got into this pork chop here. Nice cook on the pork chop here. Mm. Oh yeah. Nice taste that savory spice. I'll put some sweet apple with it. Mmm. Just perfect. It's always nice to use things that are in season, like the apple pork chop, just delicious over the grill. Thanks for joining me today. If you enjoyed this cook, smash that like button. Okay, you gotta click subscribe so you don't miss any of these good cooks. We'll see you next time on Barbecue with Greg.